everybody, uh, Marcher League here, and today I am playing some Force of Nature Scout, and this is a demo recording, recorded afterwards, and yeah, you might notice some things are different if you ever watch my stuff, I have a new HUD, and that, that, that's it, that's it. Anyway, I was playing, and the demo got messed up because that like weird update came out, so I'm killing blue team people, and I am on blue team. That's going to be really fun to watch happen. And I'm doing the infamous Sandman guillotine combo here. And I believe I get more kills like with the ball and guillotine individually than I do with the actual combination of them. So I guess I want to talk about how fun the force of nature is. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to talk about what I'm doing here I guess. Uh, on upward. It's super fun for our guillotines because it's all open and I don't know what the hell I was just doing right there. I <laughs> just threw everything for no reason and we lose. Oh, check out my loadout. I'm an elf. And there's me messing with the demo controls. Ignore that. Okay, so we started the other round and I'm still playing the same scout. I think my next gameplay is also this. I've just been playing the scout lately even though I'm pretty, pretty awful at it. Force of Nature looks really ugly when it's a festive, but... It's, uh, it's the best I got, and I'm, I'm fucking with the demos again. I think I break it just now. I'm trying to do something. The UI just doesn't work for me. So, yeah, let's watch me do this. Come on. Oh, God. I remember this. <laughs> I, I chose a time to skip to, and it has to play through the entire thing. So, yeah, you get to watch this. What a great video. Uh, I played a bunch of other random classes in the beginning because I wanted to, like, do a showcase because I got some new hats. Some new stuff happened. I wanted to show it off. Oh yeah, I literally rewinded it all the way to show this one this one thing. I got that pyro. Perfect. <laughs> oh what a fucking what a great what a great worthwhile experience. I think this is actually looking pretty smooth on my end right now. It was pretty choppy when I was watching it the first time around, so I didn't feel like doing it. Uh, let me see if I can run by a mini sentry because they're just like level one sentries with a little light on their heads. It's hilarious. Come on, do something. Fucking throw that ball, guy. I don't even know how to commentate this because everyone is blue. Wait, no, I'm technically red because we have some team colored stuff that's red. I don't know how the soldier here doesn't hit me. I'm gonna say it's because I had the force of nature and I'm jumping around like a moron. I don't believe. And then, there it is, the little baby sentry. With a little light on it, like a, a little fedora. Oh. Is he on? No, no, that was an enemy soldier. See? What is happening? What is happening? I don't know. I'm back. Back in blue. And. I immediately go and waste my time hunting for a spot. I think I get him, though. No, I don't get him. I'm just wasting my time. Force of Nature is a great weapon, though. Everyone should use it. And I think that... I don't know. I don't know if I'm trying to, like... Ooh. So you got that Sam and then you get the guillotine. I don't know if I'm just being, like, super egotistical. But I feel like a lot of people started using it in the servers that I was using. Let's see, that scout was using the Force of Nature. I normally never see anybody use the Force of Nature. But, I don't know. I haven't been playing a lot of TF2 lately. Maybe it's the new meta. I miss a point blank heavy, but it's okay. I get the cleaver. This is what I'm talking about. I'll miss one, hit the other, and it somehow still works out. I wish I launched him off the cliff. And I think I wanted to... I'm so... Right. Because blue is good, but blue is also bad. And bang, bang. That one, two. Don't kill him, though. The one time I get the one, two on somebody. Oh, well. Didn't really expect that. I was trying to hit the medic, but the medic was behind everybody. I'm on red team. I keep forgetting that. That's so weird. Alright. Oh, Festive Sandman, by the way. I have all the Festives now, I think. I'll make a video on that later. I just want to wanna make a video showing off that I have all the Festives before the next Christmas update. So I have to start all over again. Um, I get an assist on that soldier. Don't know who or what reflected him, man. This is embarrassing. I miss. And I have to chase him down. Never mind, that wasn't that bad. I think there was one time... Oh, get out of town. Where I was shooting at a sniper. I launched him up, did 124 damage. Oh, my throat. And then I just couldn't kill him afterwards. Oh, yeah, this gameplay happened a while ago. What is happening? Do I? I don't even know who I'm throwing at. Let's just say this is this is what man versus machine should have been. Except the fighting machines, not each other. I should have killed him. I'm really bad at lining up the second shot for the force of nature. But I'm still practicing, I guess. 
Let's see if I do anything flashy. I think I get like a, a one or two crit guillotine kills in this game. I've been alive for a while. Which means I've been talking non-stop for a while. And I don't know how to do that. So forgive like the return to commentary. I missed that, hit the cleaver, and then now I'm in a pickle. Because I, I don't want to run behind them, but there's a heavy that knows where I am. So I run behind them anyway and I get... I think I get really lucky. Yes, I do. Goodbye. You did not deserve to die there. I did not deserve to get out. And that that's a friendly. Oh, here's the jump. You do a little force of nature jump and you can get all the way up here. And no one expects it. And watch me use this to my excellent advantage by running away and not doing anything with it. Yeah, that's about how most of this game goes. <laughs> Holy cow, why is the sentry over there? It's a terrible place to put the sentry. Come on, do something, boy. Do something fun. Hit that pyro. Oh, you missed. Oh, see, I get the cleaver kill again. Oh, I really wish I hit that demo while he was flying. Except he hit me while I was flying instead, so whatever. Alright, so, I skipped around a bit. I think when I cut out some other stuff. I don't even know why I'm telling you this right now. And whoop, missed everything. If I just hit either one of those, I think he would have been dead. And this soldier, see, look how powerful this weapon is. That was 200 damage in like three shots from kind of medium distance. And that's why more people should use it. Medic didn't deserve to die. I really don't think he had less than 90 health. And I'm killing a blue spy and the scout. I think, no, 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 I, I get away with some cheeky shit here. Why am I spoiling all this? Do I get away with some cheeky shit? Yeah, see, I get the ball kill. I got more ball kills than crit guillotine kills. I'm 90% sure of that. Every time, I don't know how to commentate this. Every time I see blue guys running at me, I'm like, oh god, I'm about to die, but they're, they're my blue guys. That, and I burn. Slain by the earth. And I'm back. I think I've actually been doing decently well this game. And I don't know if this is ranked. I think this is actually like regular cat. Ooh, goodbye, sir. Regular casual matchmaking. Got the ball, didn't get the cleaver. And... I, I I don't know about anyone else, but the the kill count, like the stats, where they're like, oh yeah, you have this many kills, this many deaths, that really pisses me off when I'm playing, because I, I want to have like good KD, man, and I used to not care, because like, it wouldn't show you, but now it shows you, and I'm not into that, I really, I, I really aren't, man, so I've been playing a lot of community servers, like 24-7 Harvest, that wasn't a spy, and it's, uh, it's really made me not good at the regular game because there's like a different thing going on with the 24-7 servers because everybody's like every sniper and ambassador spy is like a god and then you have like a bunch of WM1 powers running around I don't know what's going on in them so I think we're about to get rolled after we lose that point because our engineer like disconnected which is a real shame because we were doing so well uh, I think they were in overtime and then they pushed and then they won so uh, whatever they did they did good did that spy just stab I don't know going for this soldier change my mind oh if I just landed the shot any of those shots I'm pretty sure I would have been fine no I probably wouldn't have yet it's way too much health still yeah, so anyway I've been thinking of making an update video just uh let some people know what I've been up to if they give a damn and uh, I've been trying to make a video with someone else uh, but that's not working out too well uh, I don't know what I'm talking like this I hit the stun ball didn't get the guillotine was that an uber? I think only his weapons became ubered that's kinda funny and I have both the stuff up again I think I don't know you can't uber I mean you can't stun ubered players anymore that would be way too good for the sandman have to take like a 70 health penalty for that. I don't know, I've always been wary of using the stand, man, because it hits a pretty important damage threshold. Because I think soldiers... No, wait, no, I don't think they can one-shot you. Boop. Don't chase a scout. Just kidding, chase a scout. There's no reason why you wouldn't. Most of them are ballsy enough to pull up what I just did. I don't know why I looked at that sentry for so long. Look at it, so cute. And hey, look at that, we lost. It was a good game, it was a fun game. It was some fun. Finals are over for me. I'm allowed to have fun. Bye.